Welcome to Unpack Your Financial Baggage, where we help you answer one simple question. Will you outlive your money or will your money outlive you? Here are your hosts, certified financial planner and managing partner of Malone Private Wealth, Lou Malone, and editor of D-Business Magazine, RJ King. Today, we're covering the topic, how to choose a financial advisor. It's a topic filled with anxiety and a lack of resources, although it may be the single most important decision people make regarding their retirement and for generations to come. Now, no pressure on this question, Lou, but many people are wondering how to choose the financial planner who best matches their retirement goals. It's a topic that at some point will be, uh, I think it's probably going to be at the forefront of everyone's mind. However, the match between planner and client actually goes both ways. It, It may sound strange, but the elite planners are also deciding who's the correct fit for their practice as well. What do you mean by that? You know, in our industry, it's viewed like this. Do you want a customer or a client? What's the difference? To me, a customer is temporary, always searching for the highest return, which doesn't exist as, you know, there's no guarantee of the persistence of performance, historically speaking. However, they're consistently jumping from firm to firm searching for, kind of like the fountain of youth. Is this what the term chasing performance means? Yeah. Always chasing last year's winner, which, you know, by the way, is the perfect recipe for a lifetime of underperformance. That's why in our prior podcast, we discussed the investor behavior gap. So then how do you define a client? Well, I think a client is one who trusts the planner's philosophy and the planning process. Uh, They adhere to the principles and practices that have historically both, I would say, created and preserved long-term generational wealth. Now, this takes patience and discipline to accomplish. The information provided is for educational, informational purposes only and does not constitute investment advice, and it should not be relied on as such. It should not be considered a solicitation to buy or an offer to sell a security. It does not take into account any investor's particular investment objectives, strategies, tax status, or investment horizon. You should consult your attorney or tax advisor. The views expressed in this commentary are subject to change based on market and other conditions. These documents may contain certain statements that may be deemed forward-looking statements. Please note that any such statements are not guarantees of future performance, and actual results or developments may differ materially from those projected. Any projections, market outlooks, or estimates are based on certain assumptions and should not be construed as indicative of actual events that will occur. All information has been obtained from sources believed to be reliable, but its accuracy is not guaranteed. There is no representation or warranty as to the current accuracy, reliability, or completeness of, nor liability for, decisions based on such information, and it should not be relied on as such. Malone Private Wealth LLC, MPW, is a registered investment advisor. Advisory services are only offered to clients or prospective clients where MPW and its representatives are properly licensed or exempt from licensure. No investment strategy or risk management technique can guarantee returns or eliminate risk in any market environment. All investments include a risk of loss that clients should be prepared to bear. The principal risks of MPW strategies are disclosed in the publicly available form ADV Part 2A. Generally, among asset classes, stocks are more volatile than bonds or short-term instruments. Government bonds and corporate bonds have more moderate short-term price fluctuations than stocks, but provide lower potential long-term returns. U.S. Treasury bills maintain a stable value if held to maturity, but returns are generally only slightly above the inflation rate. This has been the Unpack Your Financial Baggage podcast. Feel free to share this episode with someone you think it may benefit. You can also follow our show on Apple Podcasts, Spotify, or wherever you're listening right now. To learn more about Malone Private Wealth, visit MalonePrivateWealth.com. The Unpack Your Financial Baggage podcast is produced by Jack and Detroit Podcasts.